I actually have a story that I'd like to share uh, uh, regarding, uh, I had a little bit of an, an, inc- an incident that happened this past week. So um, on Monday, I had a chessboard uh, come in the mail. Um, this is where quarantine has taken me. I bought a chessboard to take up to the bar and play chess, which doesn't sound all that fucking dumb. I mean, it's not dumb. I don't think it's dumb. Maybe it's a little weird, but I've had I have I've had friends join me and we play games. Josh even has played a few. I mean, we've been playing quite a bit. Cameron, Cameron, if you remember Cameron, we've uh, yeah, we played played as well. Even Justin. In fact, yeah. I think I've had almost all my guests, um, almost all of them have uh, played chess with me. So they are my friends. So that's, you know, that's confirmed. Uh, <laughs> so, but anyway, I had, so I had, um, so I was playing by myself. And I think this happened on Tuesday, was it? Was it Tuesday? I think it was. Yeah, so, um, so, I was sitting up by myself and just practicing and all that, all that jazz. And so there's this guy, um, I won't give away his name, uh, not a big fan of his though. Uh, and he had a friend of his and he's not a very well liked person at at the bar or my, my place that I go to. Um, he, uh, he, he kinda, he's kind of annoying and He's also a creep, like a like a big time creep, and so, uh, so he he, yeah. You know, but I'm being the nice being the nice fella that I am. I, I, I'm inviting of almost anybody, and I've learned a lesson today or yeah, this week on why I shouldn't be so shouldn't always be so damn nice, um, and so this guy. He don't, he wants to join me and play chess, so I'm all like, "All right, all right, fine, yeah, let's let's play." All right, don't really want to fucking play with the guy, but once again, nice guy, nice guy, and me uh, caved in. And he had a friend, and his other friend, whom I will not name, uh, sat. They were you know they sat by you know they sat at my table. His friend sat beside me. And we were playing, and this guy, so his friend, uh, what we'll, we'll, we'll call his friend T, and then this, and then this guy will be named J. Uh, so J, J and I we were playing chess, and then T, he decides to say like, "Oh yeah, I got this. You know, I I made a chess board. I made a chess board. Uh, you know, ha- I, by hand I made one." And I was like, "Oh, that's cool, dude." And I was actually. I, I'm like, well, that's pretty cool, actually. So five minutes later, though, uh, I made this chessboard. I, I love the same, same, said the same fucking thing. I'm like, uh, all right, yeah, yeah, that's 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 cool, dude. All right, cool. And then another five minutes later, oh yeah, yeah, I made a chessboard, and I'm like, and it's just like, dude, you, I obviously you've been drinking all fucking day, and you can't even remember what the fuck you're saying anymore. So. I, yeah, so I'm after that third time. I'm kind of like, uh, all right, yeah, all right, all right, all right, bro. So, so he, so a, a, as and as he's going on about his chessboard, he's also judging the game that I'm playing with Jay. Mind you, I bought this chessboard and I had and before before I had gotten it, I hadn't played in about twenty years. Like literally twenty years, so I'm just getting back into it, and and plus I don't give a fuck. I'm not even playing it to be competitive. I'm just bored. I want something something to do, and chess is a fucking it's a it's a fucking great game to play if you just want to put all your thinking and strategy into something else, and you know all that energy into that rather than thinking about some other bullshit going on in life. It's a good. It's a, it's just a nice little game to play. Obviously. So he's judging. He's just like, oh, yeah, this game should be over. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, this is, that's a bad idea. That's a bad idea. And it's just like, dude, do you fucking mind? Like, I don't need you to – not only do I not need you to spectate, but I don't need you to fucking commentate on a game. 
like on a, on a simple game of chess do i look I mean, like the chess board is small it's not like i'm going all out here shut the fuck up so so then he moves over and oh and so here's here's what's going on uh so i had my, i had a backpack or i have a backpack and um there's three chairs and i sat in the corner of the at the one end of the table he started out at the other end and then in the middle chair uh, that's where i had my backpack and usually i have my cane uh, uh, resting on the hoop or on one of the hoops or handles of, of my backpack. And so, um, so he decided to sit, um, on, he's deci- he decided to sit right next to me on the chair, uh, the chair that had the backpack. So, so I had to, so I had to get up. I had to, I had to, I had to go take a, take a leak and, so I took my cane off and then I had a, and then I didn't want to put the cane right over the guy and bug the guy with that. I do have some manners here. So, uh, so, so then Jay and I finish up our game and, uh, and then T wanted to take off. But before that was going on, uh, Josh came by and Josh and I started playing. And so yeah, Josh and I start playing our game and we, uh, so we, you know, we were just pretty, we were pretty locked in with, with that. So then J and T, yeah, J and T decide to, they decide to take off. And usually J is the type of person to say, say bye. And well, so they quietly left. I saw them leaving. And then I, and as soon as they, as soon as, as soon as they walked out, I looked to my left and I see that my backpack is gone. Oh, and mind you, T had his own backpack as well. So T, this motherfucker, he started taking off with my backpack. So I look to my, yeah, so I'm looking to my left and I'm like, I'm like, what the fuck? This guy, this guy just fucking took off with my backpack. So I say it, so I start getting up to leave and then three, three other people, uh, other regulars who I'm friends with up at, up at, uh, at my spot, uh, they, they all get out and, you know, they, they, they get up and they start walking outside too. I did as well. There was like four of us and, and they're still waiting. So those guys are still waiting across the street. So to my knowledge, to, to what I thought was this guy was just a drunk idiot and he just mistakenly took off with it because he didn't really, he didn't look like the type of guy that would steal it. Well, what is it? What is the looking type? This guy had gray hair, fucking 50, 60 something year old, whatever dude. Uh, and he just, I don't know, just a fucking loser. Uh, not because of his age. He just, dude's a fucking loser for taking my shit. So, so, um, what, so they, they, the guy returned my backpack to me and he gave it to one of the, one of the other people that was, that went outside. And so, and so, uh, so then I'm all, you know, I'm all like, what the fuck? So I'm rolling my eyes. I just go back inside. And then as I get back, as soon as I go inside, Jay comes in and he, and he, he, yeah, he says really quick, Oh, uh, He's like, oh, he thought it was my backpack. Uh, just sorry, sorry, and, and and I'm just like, yeah, whatever, man. Like, like whatever. It, it's it, like it, I just it, it was only my life, and in you know, with my backpack, and I I I put a lot of shit in there. I I got shit. It's my backpack. What the fuck? So, uh, so then I just at that moment I had thought that yeah, like I said, that maybe it was a drunken mistake. But then, uh, turns out what happened was that this guy on his way out, he put my backpack on him and then, and then he put his backpack right around, right on top of that. What does that tell you? That's, that seems like a guy, type of guy who's looking to fucking steal it. So that was shared with me. Josh, he was the first one to point that out to me. And then several others ended up over the last couple of days have said that too. And they're like, yeah, that dude was totally trying to fucking take off with it. So, so once again, um, these guys are not very well liked already in this place. 
And it's also not a, it's not the type of spot I'm, where people really want to start drama. Drama does tend to happen. It happens at any bar. I mean, come on, especially in this town. So, so I'm kind of really hoping that I see these guys again very soon because I, I've buried a lot of anger. I used to have a, I used to have a temper, believe it or not. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and so I've kind of buried that over the last few years. So, but what you did, what, or what they did was they fucked with me. I can be the nicest fucking chillest person ever. I can be that person. I'm usually that person, but the second you fuck with me, the second that you fuck with me, I am going to fucking, I'm going to, I'm, I'm see my, my blood is boiling thinking about this even further. I don't even know if this is a good idea for me to even be still talking about this because of the way this fucking pisses me off. So I'm getting, I'm, I'm more and more steamed about this because this, these guys, these guys suck. And they were really saying some, some, uh, that's burp number one. They were really saying some bullshit too on the way out. They were being creepy, talking, talking, just talking some weird, yeah, weird, creepy shit. Josh, Josh heard it too. And, uh, you know, so I'm hoping I see these guys again because I was going to let it go. But the more I'm thinking about it, the more I just, it's not even about being petty. It's just being like, fuck you guys. So if I see you again, and if you and if you even think it's a good idea to be near me, I will take my cane, turn that some bitch sideways, and stick it straight up their candy asses. Quoting The Rock. Fucking jabronis. So that's that. I had to get that off my chest, so I'm I'm pretty fucking that 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 got me all. That's had me fucking steamed, and I'm not gonna lie. I, I don't give a fuck. I'm 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 a small guy, I'm a little guy, but I will. I am not afraid to attempt to fuck you up. I'm not saying I will. I'm just saying I'm not afraid to attempt to fuck you up if you fuck with me. So I'm gonna end that. That's end it. All right, no more tension with that shit. All right.